Look, one of my favourite acts, Coldplay, and I know, Kate Ritchie, one of yours. Definitely. Uh, certainly right up there in my sort of top 50 all-time bands. Um, He's and, such a nice guy. And him for the weekend. Him. I know what he means now, and it, it makes a little bit more sense. Who would you like to be for the weekend? But I kind of I'd like, like the him. idea of yeah, asking yourself that question. Who would you like to be? If you could be a guy, yeah. who would you be, Kate? You can think yeah. about it. I will have to think about it. I don't like it when you put me on the spot like that because I want to have a, a, a you know. A, a, don't worry a, about it. What's the story then? <laughs> I think I'd be George Clooney if I could be a guy. Oh, really? Is that your pick? Yeah, I love an owl and <laughs> I know you do. But what about when you're George Clooney? <laughs> <laughs> I love it more. I love playing skins with Brad Pitt and just shooting hoops with the boys. Well, in that case, I'll be Brad. <laughs> okay, brilliant. So who are you? You'd be Matt Damon. I would not be Matt Damon. <laughs> and we're yes, not you inviting would, you, mate. We're not yeah. inviting because the Martian sucked. <laughs> no, I'm, not you, even, I'm not even Matt Damon. Matt so don't call me Matt Damon. You don't Damon. even understand it's that you're Matt choice. Damon. I haven't picked Matt Damon. Oh, look, listen to Matt carry on again, oh, George. God. Oh, God. See you, Matt. We're going to shoot one, hoops. I want to be Matt Damon and I don't ever want to be included again. Go to Ben Affleck's oh, house, Matt. No way. I'm yeah, never going there. Right, Goodwill Hunting again. Oh, you can't. Oh, that's right, because you didn't. Yeah, you've forgotten how to write. I'm going to hang out with an owl. Can I come? Yeah, of course you can, Brad. I'm Brad, though, yeah. Cool. yeah. Come up. I'll bring the weed. Obviously, Let- I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's get blazed, shoot some hoops without our shirts on, and then go hang with the Nile. Como? Mm. Are you at the Como house? <laughs> yeah, I'm at, I'm at the Como. Okay, good. No, not the Como in Melbourne. I'm asking if you're at the late Como house. <laughs> I wanted to stay at the Olsen, but I'm at the Como. <laughs> oh, shit, I'm in Italy. <laughs> Chris Martin um, has described his relationship with Gwyneth Paltrow as a very wonderful separation divorce. I only know them now as separate people. I don't even know them as Gwyneth and Chris anymore. No. No, I did never think of them as a couple anyway. Because you wanted to muscle your way in there. No, I didn't. Um, in an, in, in oh an interview, <laughs> shut up, Matt. I'm not We're Matt. Trying to talk, I'm trying mate. frantically over here to think of someone else I want to be. Well, it's, at the moment, you're Matt Damon. <laughs> <laughs> makes so much sense. Oh, in does a, it? Yeah, it does. In a, why don't you do another film where you're stuck to someone's hip? What was that awful thing? <laughs> I mean, on could you. you. I mean, could you imagine George Clooney and Brad Pitt having to have a conversation with a bloke who was in Stuck on You? I mean, it just is ridiculous. And Greg Kinnear. I mean, it makes sense for him. <sighs> But Matt Damon, why? get out. Well, why am I feeling so angry right now? <laughs> because you can't I know I'm not else's. Matt Damon. <laughs> but you are, though. But I'm not Matt I'm Damon. I'm Brad. And I am George. <laughs> George over there is just loving life. Um, in an interview with the Sunday Times, Chris said that he'd lived a lot of life since the two decided to go their separate ways. I'd say he'd lived a hell of a lot more life now that Gwyneth isn't around bringing mm. him down every night. Hear, hear. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, so it's okay for you to say it, but not me to chime in. No, I said okay. Whoa! I think Gwyneth actually is a lot of fun. I saw her do oh, on God. the Graham Norton show. I, she was do. great. Um, Rowley's just tweeted a great photo of George Clooney. Well, yeah. Rowley has too much time on his hands. Just, just having Kate. a laugh. Okay, there's Matt Damon. That's not Matt Damon. Can I just point out, I yeah. actually quite like Matt Damon. I, yeah. I, I don't have anything against Matt Damon, but I don't like that you're telling me I have to be Matt Damon and you're doing that because in some way you don't have any respect for him and you think he's dull and boring and not as talented or cool as the rest. Well, that's right. And that's right. why you're saying that I have to be him. Well, Correct. I'm not Matt Damon. No, I'm never going to be Matt Damon. No, everything, really everything, that. everything you're saying is right. And it's oh, just God, like finally, this. Finally, Matt. The imaginary conversation between George and Brad Pitt where they find out a guy who's in Stuck On News coming over must have been just heartbreaking for both of them to put a brave face on when Matt Damon got out of his car. Then why mm. are you saying that I have to be Matt Damon? Why are you saying you're Matt Damon? Because you're, you're saying all bit... these things about, OK, Marty, how he hit me with it. Because you're a little bit like Matt Damon. <laughs> I like Matt Damon? You know, in The Martian, you're like that. Yeah, but oh, also what they accidentally <laughs> left him on the moon or wherever I know. he was. <laughs> I know how ridiculous I that they leave that. a bloke on the moon. Yeah, but they left him there because he's Matt Damon. <laughs> oh God, that's what I mean. Is that what you would do to me? Oh, he was good in like the Bourne movies. Yeah, he was actually. I mean, they? sorry, you were good in the Bourne oh, movies. I don't know. <laughs> Me, I'm not Matt Damon. Well, you come up before six o'clock. Come up mm. with the man that you would rather be. I said yeah. Jay Z, but I don't yeah. want to be Jay Z. I don't want to be a man just quietly.
tweet or you'll miss it out. Oh, mate. hang on. Malgate just tweeted, Kate, give me Michael J. Fox. <laughs> oh, and why is that? Why would I be Michael J. Fox? I don't know. It's hard to do jokes about guys who suffer from early onset Parkinson's, but we'll find a way. Oh, my God. <laughs> is it because he was some kind of child star? No, I think it's more... Oh, no, I so think. she can go back to the future and get a smaller phone? <laughs> Person. And why have they taken your side? I don't know, mate. Oh, no. Oh, here we go. Kerry suggested one. What's Kerry saying? Kerry said you should be Casey Affleck. Why? Yes. Just just because. He's, he's building he's really some good. momentum. Yeah, there you go. He's far more talented, I think. Oh, and more I agree. interesting. You still, you, Matt Damon. You still can't come no, over to no. our place, though. <laughs> we were shooting hoops on Lake Como. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> no, don't call me Maddie. And because guess what? Do you know what the bottom line is? I know I'm not Matt Damon, so I don't know why I'm letting it upset me so much. I don't know why you're so upset you about it. Because you could be you're, worse. you're using it as a little. You're trying to have a go at me by saying I'm Matt Damon. Matt. No, <laughs> you, it's an, you're trying to insult Kate Ritchie no. by saying that I'm no. Matt Damon because no. you don't have any respect for no. Matt Damon. No, no, no. Don't no, know me, no, mate. No, don't no, know no, me. No, I won't hear a word of that. We're mi- you're misreading us. You okay. misunderstand, Damo. No, everyone knows. <laughs> everyone knows this is the truth. That's why no, they're jumping on board on Twitter me. because they want you to read out their tweet and have you laugh at them to make them feel better no. this afternoon. No, you're misunderstanding. But also, don't have a go at the Twitter community and, and their motivations. Oh, they're, they're important.